Then I just got this. It says super aging, super aging serum. It's gonna age you. <laughs> super anti-aging serum. And I'm like, yes, that is everything I need in a jar. My routine changes day to day when I'm home with my kids and it's, you know, I don't have this luxury of doing a 15 step routine. So my step might be like three things for the nighttime routine, but since I have this like luxurious hotel room and I have the time, I'm gonna do a really self care pampering night in for myself. And so I will start with taking off my makeup. And I have, um, I would say combination skin. I get really oily and dry at the same time. I don't know how that's possible, but it's a thing and I have it. A lot of these things will help with that, especially like exfoliator. I feel like it helps um, me with my combination skin and keeping it even. Um, but my first product I'm gonna use today to take off my makeup is these RMS Beauty Wipes. They're um, basically coconut oil and they take everything off. So if I have like mascara on from the day from work or if I have like a major red lip and I'm on my way to the airport to go home, I can have these in my bag and it takes everything off amazingly. If I was at home, I have like coconut oil next to my bedside table, but I don't travel with that because they're really heavy and with glass. So these are great for on the go for me. So I just start with taking all my makeup off. And the thing I love about this is I can pretty much get all my makeup off with one wipe. So that is really handy. I've actually told so many makeup artists about it because they leave so much for us at the end of the day. They'll have like Q-tips and cotton pads with all these different creams. And I'm like, you just need to get these. It takes everything off on one pad and we can take it to go with us, which is so nice. So, you know, for me, I just want to always get home to my baby. So I'm like as fast as possible through everything to get home. But look at how easy that was. Like. It's gone. My well, mascara is gone. My makeup is pretty much off. Bam, makeup is off. I'm gonna put my hair up because I wanna keep this gorgeous blowout. You know, when I'm at home, I don't have time to blow my hair out. So I'm gonna savor this blow up for as long as I can. With this slip hair tie, I love it. It's silk, it's really pretty. So I can wear it out and about, um, but it also will help with not putting creases in my hair, which I love. Um, and it looks really nice. So my next step is this glow face balm. Anything that says balm in it and glow, I'm sold. That's all I want is a glowy, balmy face. <laughs> so this is really good. It smells good, it feels good. I've been into balms lately for like as my cleanser. I think it makes my skin still feel soft and supple, which I really like, um, but takes everything off. It makes me glow, balmy glow. So, and it's got these like little kernels in it. I just like rub it around everywhere. I fall asleep with makeup on regularly. <laughs> like it just depends on my day and what time I get home. I try if like I'm just really exhausted, I'll try to take at least my face makeup off. At least my skin is breathing, but I've definitely woken up with a full set of lashes and gorgeous eye makeup still on. And I'm like, hmm, this is actually quite nice. I actually did a um, makeup with Hung recently who does some amazing makeup and I got home. I flew home after the job and I was so tired and I used the wipe on my face, but I left the eye makeup on and I woke up the next day and I was like, honestly, if this makeup looks major, and I might just keep this eye makeup on for the, for the day. And like my husband was like, you, you look so beautiful. Everybody was like, look at you all dolled up for the day. I'm like, no big deal, I did it myself. Okay, so I basically just, um, Got some warm water to take this balm off and it's helping get rid of any extra kind of makeup. And my skin feels so soft. That's the thing I love about a balm instead of like a soapy cleanser is like your skin still feels so nice. That is all I need. So this is Dr. Gross Alpha Beta Extra Strength Daily Peel. I love these so much. It's such, if I'm like have a big shoot and I'm shooting the, um, the next day, I will use these and my skin is so glowy in the morning, like noticeably different. I think using them like once or twice a week is amazing. And when I first did it, I would do both steps, but now, um, you know, I kind of like it extra strength. So I'll just leave it on. Um, and, th and then after two minutes, you do step two, but I try, I kind of like just leave it on and let it marinate and, um, I have so many more steps that it all kind of like blends in together. But I'll try to leave it for like two minutes uninterrupted so I get the like full exfoliation effect. Um, especially my hands, cause your hands age too. So I try to keep 
this all anti-aging and I think these are really good for anti-aging and just like getting that really beautiful glow. So I did step one and now after two minutes I'm doing step two and I'm taking it off with this wipe. Now I have a beautiful exfoliation. My skin is toned, hydrated, exfoliated. Okay, so next step. I love sheet masks and um, since I'm having a nice night in, I am gonna take the time for myself and do a little sheet mask because I think sheet masks are a really great way to you know, keep your skin healthy and beautiful and shiny and glowy and um, not look tired and deep hydration, especially under your eyes, all these things when I'm traveling so much and I'm not sleeping as a lot. This is a day of self care and I just, I feel like being indulgent and I do face masks all the time at home anyways. So maybe in real life, I wouldn't do an exfoliator after that or something like that, but I'm gonna do like all my favorite things that I would do for myself. I love an eye mask too, because that area is so sensitive. I don't have time to do them separately. So I am gonna put them on at the same time and just let them marinate together. Like who has 40 minutes to do separate masks on their face during the day? So I'll literally do this in the car sometimes on my way to work, or I do this a lot on airplanes because I travel on airplane a lot to get to work. It's a great conversation starter. People are always like, what is on your face? Like it's hard to walk, not walk by somebody in public wearing these and be like, what are you doing? Tell me everything. And even if I have extras, I will give them to like, um, flight attendants if they ask about it or my neighbor on the seat and we'll just sit there and have a nice laugh together. And my daughter thinks it's hilarious when I wear these because I look kind of crazy. But honestly, this smells so good. And I know if I just sit and watch like um, The Crown or some great show that I'm watching on my Netflix, I can just sit there and get this extra self care. My face is gonna be so moist and hydrated and I will be ready to wake up glowing. I usually believe this on for like 20 minutes. Also like the extra stuff I'll put on my hands. I'll also get the stuff and put it on my neck and chest because that's such an important area to keep hydrated too. My makeup artist taught me that. She's like, don't waste any of that, that extra cream in there. That's good stuff. So like, I'll kind of like put it on all those like delicate areas. Sometimes when I wear this, I feel like Mrs. Doubtfire when she has the whipped cream mask on and it's like melting off her face. So this has been on for 20 minutes, wink, wink and I'm gonna take this off. The next step I'm gonna do is, the vitamin C is Core Organics. I really love this line. I love, you know, I was able to use this while I was nursing with my son and I, I love the product so much. I obviously will continue using it, and I'll, you know, that I don't have to use everything being natural, but I still love when I find products that are natural that are, um, you know, superior to the products that aren't. So I think if you can find stuff that's natural and works for you and your skin, um, it's always a bonus. But you know, not everything in this routine is, um, but Core is amazing. Okay, then I just got this. It says super aging, super aging serum. It's gonna age you. <laughs> super anti-aging serum. And I'm like, yes, that is everything I need in a jar. So I'm gonna add that to my routine. I've been trying it the last few nights and it's really hydrating and I really love that. So I'm gonna add that on top with the vitamin C. I am going to put on the skin food. So skin food is really thick and really nice, especially when you're traveling a lot. It's a great thing to put on overnight because it's really thick and it, like um, it will absorb while you're sleeping, um, which I think is really nice because kind of more rich creams as I'm getting older um, are really nice and help keep my skin looking really supple. So I'll just put that all over, all of my hands. I also really like it like on my nails, and my cuticles, all that kind of thing. Like everywhere you can keep really hydrated and it smells nice. It reminds me of Fruity Pebbles. I don't know why, like anytime I smell it, I'm like, mm, Fruity Pebbles. It's really great. Lots of makeup artists use this. I would say like 50% of the makeup artists I work with use this as the base before putting on makeup. Cause it's really, um, like shiny and pretty. So it just makes makeup look really like beautiful in pictures. So a lot of my products are natural. They're not all natural, but a lot of them are when I can find products that are natural and work really well, I'll stick with that. You know, I, I was pregnant and nursing. So for a long time, everything in my routine was all natural. So I was able to find so many amazing products because why not? That's awesome, but not everything. Um, is like I'm starting to put things back in my routine that have stuff like retinol in it, which I couldn't use while I was um, pregnant or nursing. So, you know, those kind of things get added in, but most of my stuff is as natural as I can get it. 
my next 1,000th step. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do all of these steps every night. My steps rotate daily, nightly. Sometimes I do exfoliation once a week, but I wanted to show you all of my favorite things because it's so fun and why not? And like, I want to share as much as I can. So like pick which ones sound inter interesting to you and try it. And you know, hopefully something in my routine you'll learn to, to love. Um, another thing I like love lip balm and I cannot sleep without moist lip. I actually can't do much. Like my trainers will make fun of me like, when I'm working out. Like my lip balm will come with me to each station because I just love it. It's like under me with my pillow at night. Lip balm. Very important part of my routine. Eye balm. This is Tata Harper Boosted Contouring Eye Balm. Lifting and firming. Yes, please. Thank you very much. This is what this mom who doesn't sleep very much needs in her life. I need all the lifting and firming that I can get. So this is a really nice one. Like I said, I'm really into balms lately. I just like everything to be as like moist and just balmy and dewy and just make my skin look um, just really fresh. I love this balm. It's really nice and the packaging's very beautiful. Before I go to sleep, spray a little perfume. You could also spray it on your pillow if you wanted. This happens to be by me, Lily Aldridge Perfumes. This is Summit. Um, it's really, you know, warm and cozy and gets me excited to be cozy and snuggly in my bed in my silk PJs. I'm probably gonna go lie down, listen to a little meditation. I'm gonna light it, candle, and have a nice little relaxing mom's night in with myself, meditation. You know, also a good time to do that face mask would be if you're like just having a little relax in your bed, listening to a little meditation. I like Headspace app, it's really nice. And my last step will be, going to sleep. Good night.